Uh, watch the crescent moon tonight. This is a beautiful evening. For the first time after a while, now we have a clear sky. We can see the beauty of the crescent moon. Let me see if I can zoom with this camera onto actually the moon without going to pick the telescope. Yeah, actually you can see you know, some uh, crescent details. Not much, but anyway, I can see something. And if I zoom back, yeah, uh, I can see enjoy the colors of the sunset. Let's just go downstairs and just see what can I can see. Okay, now let's look at the moon. I'll put the mobile phone on the eyepiece and let's see what we can see. And that was the view through the uh, Scobotch EDAT and Takashi 18mm eyepiece. Uh, it, it is a good eyepiece and you can actually hold the camera easy against the lens and just um, film whatever you see, record the video. It's quite easy. Uh, Skywatcher also, this gold version, Skywatcher EDAT Pro Series is really nice telescope and uh, it's very versatile 80 millimeter and it's nice okay i'm now looking with the sky watcher uh, nirvana uh, four millimeter eyepiece and as you can see i can see a lot of details mare chrysium is very easily visible and at the edge of the moon also i can see a lot of jagged line of the hills and uh, valleys quite nice and the movement is smooth I'm, I'm really pleased with the with the way that I can hold the, my hand against the eyepiece and capture the scene you see a little bit darkness in the middle of the moon somewhere uh, beside being of course that is a Mare uh, Serenitatis I think or Fecundotatis <laughs> But there is also a branch of tree poking there, so it's not focused because I'm focused on the moon. But you can see a silhouette, a shadow kind of thing in there. That's the branch of the tree. And despite that, I, I think that uh, I have good details here. Pleasing details. And that's actually the visual view of the moon now I'm just showing you. 